Some things never seem to change, where there's polka, pierogies, and playtime in Bethlehem's downtown. There is a music fest, of course, and this is the way it was back then, when the fest was just a few years old. Now the Christmas City's Carnival is celebrating the big 2-5. Well, and things have certainly changed since the music first fest first burst on the scene back in 1984. Yep, WFMZ's Bo Colt now is live at the 69 News Plots with a look back for us, Bo. Rob and Wendy, Music Fest hatched from humble beginnings to being a national force and drawing top musical acts and plenty of fans. <laughs> Music Fest started on Saturday, August 18, 1984. 118 live performances, six stages, with Don McLean being the first to headline the main stage. 300 volunteers carried the tune of the festival. 182,000 people saw and heard it all for the first time. The numbers have grown to over 500 performers, 14 stages, 2,000 volunteers, and more than a million yearly visitors. Back in 1984, when Music Fest was first formed, there were um, stores on Main Street that were closing up because of the malls were moving in, and, and Bethlehem really needed some help back then, and Music Fest is a true testament to being able to pull the community together and turn it around. 1987, attendance topped 500,000 for the first time. Three years later, The Temptations played to a crowd of 22,000. And from the beginning, we've covered it all. For the thousands of people who are coming to Music Fest, the first question that has to be answered is where to park in downtown. Parking is at a premium, and so the festival has an alternative to help out visitors. And Including 1994, the festival's wettest year, when rain canceled several shows. But things turned bright quick. By the next year, attendance hit a million for the first time. Record crowds continued in 2002 and 2006. Hopes for ArtsQuest, the festival organizers is, to keep that trend in tune this year. 